It's day 90. I'm in central Kansas and I have a very short but very cold river that I need to cross. And uh, for some reason on this trip, my feet are extra sensitive to cold water. So this is just going to be the most, this is going to be pretty painful. Um, I have my, uh, my boots off. I don't want to get them wet. Oh, here we go. Oh, this is going to be awful. Come on. Come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, fuck. Oh, that's painful. That was about as bad as it sounded. And I can't get this dog to stop following me. Go home. Go home. Go back home. I actually wouldn't mind the companion, but... He would be a burden in town and such. Plus it belongs to someone else. Go away! Go away! Go away! Oh, you're such a sweetheart. I don't know what to do. I can't be... You go back home! It's a stupid dog. He keeps running in the middle of the road. The of the road. I don't know what to do. So I can't believe I have to do this, but there's a, a narrow bridge up here that's fairly busy. I can't get through there because there's a cage and that's an even busier road and this dog is really stupid when it comes to roads and cars so I'm trying to put the leash around his neck. This is a terrible situation. stupid, okay? Uh, string is an extra string for my tent. This dog is just so stupid. It went into a fence. Now it can't find, it can't find a way out.
I'm here to watch The Hobbit. It's Christmas. So the dog issue is resolved. I took it to the police station yesterday and uh, we tried to find the phone number of the owner because I knew the house that it ran from. Uh, however, we couldn't find that, so it was taken to the uh, pound. And uh, this morning I felt so guilty about that because they said they were going to put it down in three days. If it's not claimed, I um, found the uh, address and phone number on whitepages.com and it appears everything's resolved and the dog is gonna the dog's gonna live and 